Hey, what a day. Look at this. This is beautiful. It's like 16 degrees, blue skies. What's going on? I went uh, on a quick trip abroad for a little break, well needed, uh, only for a, a weekend. Um, and I got back Sunday, today's Tuesday, uh, and the weather was freezing. It was horrible yesterday, it was raining. I thought, God almighty, where's, come on, the, the weather should be starting to get nice. Now, trouble is now, uh, where am I going here? Oh yeah, um, the trouble is now, this is the kind of day where I wouldn't want to be working away. I'd like to be at home because, you know, it's one of those days, finish work, take the walk, dog for a walk down the canal, beautiful weather, maybe stop for a cheeky pint, you know, well, that's the law, isn't it? As soon as the sun comes out, be a guy of weather. We're English after all. You know, just the one, obviously, because you know how we all love going just for one. Ha! <laughs> that don't work. But, anyway, <laughs> I suppose the reason I'm doing this is me, one of my mates, me. You might know him, you might not. If you know him, he's a good lad. He's always saying, you go away all the time, you work away all the time. You go to nice hotels, not always nice. Um, you eat good food, not always good. But he says you get people doing these blogs and stuff. Or vlogs, is it? I don't even know that. And, and, and people watch them. And he says, oh, you should do that. And I'm like, yeah, the only problem I can see there is these people have something to talk about. 99% of my travelling, I'm bored. I'm bored for the 99% of it because I'm working away on my own. Do you know what I mean? It's not really anybody else to talk to. It's not really... So I thought, nah, I can't be bothered doing any of that. And I sort of put it on hold. Well, not put it on hold, just didn't bother doing it. Um, but then I thought, do you know what? If I started doing it, then that might make it more interesting because then I've got to go out. A lot of the times I go, I get to the hotel, I'm tired, I've been working all day, I go, uh, just order food, just order food and I sit and watch Netflix and uh, the board. Uh. So it's, it might actually make me get off my ass and go out and do something and find some nice things and maybe show you guys a few of the nice things. That's if anybody bothers watching because who knows? It might just be my mates and my family, like, just checking on the missing, seeing I'm not as much as an idiot as what they think I am. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll see how it goes. At the moment, I'm on my way down to Guildford. I've only just left because I had to sort of clean the van. Uh, I was looking for receipts this morning because, as usual, I lose my receipts and work not like that. Um, so I had a good look. I cleaned all the van out. I'm gonna give it a little wash. Uh, and then I had to go pick my tablets up before I left uh, Ilkeston. I live in Ilkeston now, I don't live in Manchester anymore. Um, so, yeah, I'm on my way to Guildford. By the time I get there today, it's probably just gonna be hotel time. I will check in on my job and make sure it's okay, see what they've got. Um, if I get there early enough, which I doubt, I mean, he's saying I'm going to be there for about three years, but I've got to stop and have some lunch somewhere on the way. Um, so it might just be a case of getting in the hotel. But I've got two big days down there. Uh, but we'll see what we get up to. Hopefully I can get a little bit of um, a film done in and around the hotel. I've stayed there before. I'm staying at a place called The Drummond in Albury. I know it's nice. It's a little inn. I always prefer to stay in little inns for the price the, the cheaper as for a start and usually nicer because they put more pride into it it's not just like um we like your premier inns and your holiday inns they're all exactly the same and what i find is when you go down to the bar or the restaurant or wherever the reception everybody's sort of in their own little bubble they're sat on their iphones they're sat on the tablets the the on the laptops in their own little business world or i mean nobody really speaks to it each other but that's more of a problem when I go down south anyway than anywhere further north to get people more interested but I find with little inns you know I can just go up to the bar and there's a, there's a guy at the bar and I go hi hey, hey, mate you all right how's your day going and you'll have a little conversation it might only be a couple of minutes it could be longer you know but you meet people you chat to them and you sort of get a bit of life that way I 
fine when I stay in the hotels and I turn around to anybody, especially more down south, which is where I'm going today. It's more like, hey, how are you doing? And it's sort of like, yeah. And, and they walk away, you know, it's like you're just trying, you're trying to murder them or rob them or whatever it is they're used to. <laughs> um, it feels a bit awkward. The more north I tend, I tend to stay, the more north, the more easier, the more north that gets, the more easier it gets to approach people and you know generally have a conversation sometimes you get a little conversation like i said sometimes it can be a long conversation sometimes it can be a longer conversation than you really wanted and you end up picking that round one random nutter who wants to tell you all about his life like you know you just wait say all right mate how's your day gone and get a generic answer you know maybe talk for a couple of minutes you know and then I've got the whole history of what colour his dog is and how long he's lived where he is. He's like, yeah, I don't want to know, mate. I've had enough now, I'm bored. <laughs> it's a bit, a bit harsh, really, that. But, uh, yeah, so I'll see how it goes anyway. I'll try and fit something else on later. Hopefully, give you a little show of the hotel. Maybe the food. People find that boring these days, I know. Uh, but if there is something around the place, I can't remember. I have stayed there before. I know it's nice. But if there is something around the hotel what's interesting maybe for once i'll go out and check it out i mean i used to do that quite a lot but over the years i've just got bored can't be arsed and the job's too tiring sometimes long drives long hours and then you can't be bothered moving um like i've said so hopefully this will drag me out and get me do something so hopefully I'll have a little bit more later and that's a bleeding long intro that's a lot longer than I wanted but anyway peace well two and a half hours to go um I think it's time to listen to a little music what music are we having today who knows let's see I'll film some little bits of me being a knob like I usually am singing along the top of my voice getting weird looks from everyone around me who cares? Let's have some music. It's a sunny day! Madrid win the Champions League more than anybody else it would well, that's it. and I must admit I think they are different my own view is Real Madrid anybody else maybe yet, but Real Madrid when they and they mate you're in the second lane the overtaking lane doing 50 mile an hour it's a public road, it's not yours. You don't own it. Move over, move over. Bell end. Last time actually I was in, I was in uh, 
here, it's got a nice little waterfall and things at the back if I remember rightly. Oh, it's a bit tight, it's a bit tight for the van. It's a bit tight. Managed it though. We've done it. See, look at this. Well, this is beautiful. Oh, oh God, am I going? Oh, mm, God, can I get the van across this? <laughs> oh, dear. I'm not, I'm not liking it. I'm not liking it. Oh, my word. This is a bit. Now we're talking. Oh yeah, happy days. Uh, nice little rooms. You got, you know, you got a nice TV. You got robes. If you got robes, you know it's always all right. Bed looks great. Put stone on these walls. Nice little bathroom and shower, etc., etc., etc. Right. Let's get it and see what's around. Me. I haven't brought the handle for the GoPro. Um, just hold it in my hand. It's a beautiful place. Got a little stream here. A little stream there. Apparently there is. Uh, What's well, the same stream? <laughs> Apparently there is a little waterfall nearby. Um, I'm not quite sure where to find that. That's just the car park. This is a bridge I had to drive across in the van before, which was a bit dodgy coming in from that angle. Check this. It's like a little bit that goes around the main bit. Right. Oh. Day. I'd like to know where the waterfall is, but there's a picture of it on the website, but um, not here. Anyway, let's go make the best of this, most of the sun. Don't usually drink during the week, <clears throat> but it's the first sunny day, so pack number two, cruise camp or cheers. bed I've had my food I've watched a bit of rubbish um, I've been trying to upload some of this stuff but it's very slow I think I need a cable watching uh, a tablet in bed watching people eat food and you know all that boring stuff uh, anyway not much of a video I suppose but we'll see what we can do good night